with your Lakers, Chris. I'm ready for some free VC. Which former NBA MVP did the Lakers trade for in the 2021 NBA offseason? Was it Derrick Rose? Downtown Los Angeles. That's the location for the Knicks. He'll weave in and out of traffic all night long. He'll leave your head spinning. Kemba Walker looking to light a spark for his team tonight as they get primed for action at Staples Center. Knicks, Lakers, just moments away, right after this. Saturday night and live on 2K Sports. 
We've got the excitement of the NBA for you tonight. Hi, everyone. This is Kevin Harlan with Chris Weber and Greg Anthony, and our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. A moment now to look at the year-to-year -year scoring output and how it has been trending for Kemba Walker. And looking at his offensive numbers from the past few years, it seems like teams around the league have kind of figured him out. Uh, he's having to work a lot harder for his points, and they haven't been coming nearly as easily as they used to. Yeah, before we get going, let's hear from David Aldridge on the sideline. David? Kevin, great to hear from you. And Anthony Davis often is in the conversation for Defensive Player of the Year and even MVP, but don't expect him to indulge in that talk. He said, if I play to my potential, then those just happen. But winning another title, anchoring our defense, staying healthy, those are the types of goals I set for myself. Kevin? You always have priorities very straight with you, David. Thank you. Two very athletic teams here, Greg. A game that's sure to produce a lot of highlights. And makes me think of Stacey Auburn, one of the greatest athletes I ever played alongside. And now the New York Knicks starters. In the forward positions, Barrett and Randall. Kemba Walker is out there with Evan Fournier, and it's Noel in at the five spot. And for Los Angeles, the two megastars are the big men, LeBron and Davis. Avery Bradley is out there with Russell Westbrook, and it's Ariza in at the three, the small forward. James, and LeBron. finished off by LeBron. Such blinding speed on the drive. I mean, James is a force of nature when he's on the attack. Pope loose. Driving in and finished LeBron. off by LeBron. Well, if you don't take care of the ball, fellas, that's what can happen. Absolutely, Greg. That makes the turnover even more painful. Yeah, going defense to offense in an instant. Every team now calibrated to do that. A reason no luck. Here's Davis, and Davis throws it down. Well, there's no secret that Davis can be a dominant figure on the offensive glass. I mean, and he turns those rebounds into points. Walker against James. And that one, good. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Yeah, very little resistance. And he had to bring much faster help than that. He gives up a lot of size to most other power fours, but not too many of them can fly like he can. LeBron's gotten all three of his shots to fall for him. Three, four, three. It's Noel atop the key. Just around a minute and a half into the first quarter. There's Walker with the three. One up, one down. Two points with his first shot this game. Well, look at Walker's percentages from beyond the arc. I mean, tremendous improvement over the last few years. And Westbrook, here we go. And the shot goes in. Look at this. You got to body him up when he's in the paint. If you play off of him, then that's just two easy points. Walker with a clean look. And again, it's New York. Executing the plan here early. Still haven't missed a shot. Lakers have gone 5 of 6 so far for the field to start out the game. Or 3 Westbrook. Kemba Walker with the rebound. For New York, they've gotten their first three shots to go in for him to start off this game. And defensively, no matter the size of the man he's guarding, Walker really puts up a fight. Some smaller guards pretend to battle. But Walker will bang with you, try to front you, pull on your jersey, whatever it takes. He backs down from no one. Here's Davis. And it goes down two points. Davis has got his second basket. And what's your take, guys, on the hustle sticks for Los Angeles? They're setting the tone early with their defense, keeping the pressure on and taking chances. And they've got a bunch of steals to show for it. And also, defensively, they've been able to cause some turnovers tonight. And, and that also builds confidence and gives you momentum. Fournier's shot is off. Lakers leading by five. Davis kicks to James. Over Randall. And James gets it to go on the assist by Davis. Eight points for LeBron. And the story here, Kevin, early on is how well they shot the basketball. Fournier pass to Randall. And there's the call on James. That's his first foul. Yeah, 
and first quarter. We're about three and a half minutes in. To the inside. Oh, you got to give it up for James. He's a rugged, tough-nosed defender. Thanks mainly to his size, his speed, strength, and IQ. Oh, yes, he did. Five up and five down for him so far. Yeah, these defenders just look a bit overmatched, especially inside. Pass to Walker. Now Randall. Reza covering. Randall no good. Look, they say there are no easy finishes in the NBA, but that should be easy. And he gets it to go. And that's 12 points for LeBron. This system is set up perfectly for him. I mean, it's allowing him to find a lot of good shots. And so New York calls timeout. They're first. They come into this one following the loss to the Grizzlies. Well, in that one, you could pretty much see the writing on the wall. Their performance was lackluster at best. They just weren't ready for that game. It looked like they just weren't prepared. The final score tells you the story. stats for James the past month has been surreal he's averaging 30 points eight rebounds and five assists and the phrase stats don't lie absolutely applies here he's been a monster on the court for this team uh, he's oozing with confidence I mean and it shows every time he steps on the floor he expects to dominate Shots good by Walker. Uh, Walker. And although he's smaller, Walker doesn't fear going inside. I mean, he knows he can get a shot over anyone. The drive by LeBron. And LeBron. finished off by LeBron. Really seizing the momentum of this game, but doing it with a methodical approach. They decided to pound the ball inside, using their physicality to set the tone. And so it's New York with it after the basket by Los Angeles. On the pass to Barrett. Knocks down the three ball. Efficiency. I mean, that's an area where Walker has improved. No need to force it. Keep your eyes up. Make the right basketball play. Here's LeBron. And James throws it down. Displaying intensity right off the opening tip, especially on the offensive end. Yeah, they've been very aggressive. And they've taken early control of this game. Now here's Randall. He had an 18-point outing in the last game against Memphis. The drive by LeBron. And the tuck by LeBron. Their play on both ends has been superb. We'll see if they can maintain the momentum. Yeah, we got to be careful. It's still early. They've expended a lot of energy, but they've also built a nice cushion here. Here's Walker. After the basket by Los Angeles. That's his fourth basket of the game, and he's only taken four shots off to a good start. How about the quick feet of Walker? They really come into play on his drives to the rack. Nice shot by James. James. The defense not putting up any fight on the inside. They've allowed 10 straight points in the paint. Here's Walker going inside. No one near Randall as he lets it go. The shot's good on the assist by Walker. Walker's got three assists now in this one. And so James will bring it up for Los Angeles. Nine-point game. Last game matched up with the Clippers. A tough loss there. Yeah, tough game on the road. The guys you're defending, obviously comfortable shooting in their own building. You've got to find a way to break their rhythm. You've got to be locked in on the road. I mean, when there's no cohesiveness on defense, you're in danger. Now here's Davis following the miss by Evan Fournier. Launches a three. It's rebounded by Barrett. Knicks trail by 11. Pass to Fournier. Bradley against Noel. It's stolen by Bradley. And now it's Bradley running. He can go all the way. 
the offensive rebound and finish off by Anthony Davis. Uh, and for a big man, Davis has some sweet dunks in his arsenal. Smooth finish. Nice angle on that replay with the AT&T 5G slam cam. New York calls timeout. As the teams head into this timeout, a chance for the coaches now to map out some plays for the next few minutes and a chance for the players to rehydrate with some Gatorade. That's important if they want to make sure they don't wear down later in the game. Absolutely. Over the course of a game, you have to stay hydrated. Some changes here for the Lakers. Carmelo Anthony, he's checked in for LeBron. Horton Jocker comes in for Trevor Ariza. And Monks subbed in for Avery Bradley. And a new group in for the Knicks. Mitchell Robinson's checked in for Nerland's Noel. Gibson comes in for Randall. Radish, he's checked in for Archie Barrett. And it's Burks in for Evan Fournier. Way to showcase the court is Westbrook. I mean, he gets his teammates some wide open looks. Knocked away. Stolen by Westbrook. And it's the Lakers on the break. Anthony leading the charge. Defensively, giving up far too many open rhythm looks. Knicks trail by 17. Outside, Walker. Down low. Here's Robinson. Oh! oh. Well, that's Walker's job. Keep the ball moving. Keep creating good opportunities. Here's Monk. Again, the Lakers. And a lot of teams avoid the mid-range jumper, but they seem to be using it well. Up top, Burks. Monk defending. Reddish kicks to Burks. Passes to Walker. Five to shoot. And the wide-open shot from Reddish. That one a tad offline to the right, but drops in for him. Good anticipation on the feed. Uh, he knows exactly where to go with that ball. The tray. And Russell Westbrook with the three. Westbrook's got five. Oh, the flashy ball handling of Westbrook. So clever at creating scoring opportunities for himself. Walker the pass to Reddish. And Reddish with the slam. And one step ahead of the defense with that solid screen. And then, Greg, the monster dunk to finish it off. Well, come on, guys. Someone has to rotate over. Defensively, that's just poor communication. The shot's there for him, and he's got to take it. I don't care if he does it. That's a shot he has to continue to take. And Kimball Walker traded to the Thunder this offseason was subsequently bought out before joining the Knicks. Walker and the Knicks seem like a perfect fit. You just hope Walker can stay healthy at this stage of his career. And out of bounds as the Knicks gain possession. And New York making a change. Emmanuel quickly is checked in. Here's quickly. Kicks it to Reddish. Acted quickly. The 11-footer. Bucket is good. Oh, that's a well-deserved assist. Not every player has the vision to make that feed. It's stolen by Reddish. To the paint. Quickly the pass to Burks. Acted quickly. Off target from outside. Lakers lead by 16. Here's Davis. Up and in for the basket. Number four. That makes him four for five now. 
And defensively, guys, they've been unable to shut down the middle. To the middle. Here's Robinson. And finished off by Robinson. Oh, good interior oh. offense. Those passes have to be right on target. And so it's Anthony bringing it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. Here's Westbrook. And blocked. That one goes careening off the glass. Gibson dishes to Reddish. That shot off the mark. So Los Angeles will take it the other way. Victory eluded them last time in New York when they took on the Knicks. Well, they made a few key shots, but missed many more. It was a rough night for them offensively. Well, you know, the ball movement was lacking. And you know, things got stagnant. That's why that offense looked so off. He was all alone Emmanuel on that one. Quickly. Quickly's got five now. And that's exactly what he's looking for, draining the triple. Here's Horton Tucker. And he can't answer back the three-pointer offline. A uh, team's rebounding is a great measure of its energy. And theirs has been terrific Emmanuel here in the first quarter. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. Westbrook, it's good. Westbrook Seven Westbrook. points in the game. Four. This is Westbrook at his best, attacking, going strong at defenders, and finishing them. Knicks trail by 12. That's tipped. Faster quickly. Into the lane. Westbrook with the block. Always in a relentless pursuit of the ball. Westbrook is capable of making standout defensive plays. The Knicks shooting an outstanding 61% in the early goings. Some nice passing by New York here. Robinson, that's good. Robinson. And they keep hammering away at him inside, forcing the ball into the paint. And the Lakers have possession. Here's Westbrook. Takes it off the glass. Nine points for Russell Westbrook. Showing muscle. I love how Westbrook takes on all comers when he's trying to score. Here's Davis. Here he goes. And Davis throws it down. Well, if you don't take care of the ball, fellas, that's what can happen. Absolutely, Greg. That makes the turnover even more painful. Yeah, going defense to offense in an instant. Every team now calibrated to do that. Good if it goes. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers with a 14-point lead as we bring the quarter to a close. They've excelled in the open court. Their transition game has allowed them to build this healthy lead. And we'll be back with you shortly. Well, arguably the premier sleeper pick of the 2020 draft, Emmanuel quickly reveals the origin of his NBA-ready teardrop floater. I feel like I developed it kind of at a young age. Uh, I wasn't always the most athletic, um, so having skill was really important. So just having that floater that I could you know, use over a big man is really vital. And that shot certainly comes in handy for one of the league's smaller guards. And some call it the giant killer. That, that floater game Major is a thing of beauty. And glad to have you with us, folks. Second quarter of basketball. This game has not exactly been neck and neck, but plenty of time left in this one. And for the Lakers, this has been the game they wanted to have. Well, you can see these guys are unafraid well, to take chances time. defensively. Yeah, it's a gambling style that pays off, keeping things in disarray for that offense. So the Lakers call timeout their first. And when you look at the regular season, Chris, was there a part that was more difficult at the start, the middle, the end, where? Yeah, coming the physical toll, I think around All-Star break. That's when it gets the hardest, though. But you get a little bit of space after, you get refreshed, and then you're ready for the home stretch. All right. Look who's coming under the court. Get loud. Here they are. Your Laker Girl. All right, look 
who's coming under the court. Get loud. Here they are. Your Laker girls. Ready to go. Let's reset the lineups courtesy of Gatorade as the second quarter gets going. Taking a look at the Lakers. Howard is out there with Johnson. Then it's Malik Monk. And it's Reeves in at the two-guard spot. Whoa. Monk's shot's good. Coming a more aggressive score. Monk fighting through contact like a vet. Knicks trail by 16. Tipped away. On the wing quickly. Back to Burks. Gibson against Johnson. Bobbed up there for Robinson. Takes the alley-oop pass and dunks it down. And maybe that'll trigger them. Impossible not to get pumped up after that. Yeah, well, you can see the immediate reaction of the guys on the bench. They are pumped up. They have been more than dominant in this game. That's definitely been a factor in crafting this huge lead. Second quarter of basketball, about one minute played so far. Now, here's quickly. He's guarded closely. That is with the ball. Johnson with the block. And the exceptional athleticism from Johnson. Love how he gets up to these rejections. Here's Reeves. Reddish grabs the rebound. Reddish has got four rebounds now tonight. Burks kicks to quickly. Over to the wing. Here's Reddish. Shot clock at six. Last break. The Lakers. Here's Reeves. Rips down the breakaway slam. Well, there you go. One team operating on all cylinders at both ends. Steals, fast break buckets, and the other team in scramble mode. Time, time call here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. And the lack of rim protection, top of the list. Without question. They're giving up too many high percentage looks. A trend that they'd like to reverse. Some changes for the Lakers. James comes in for Horton Tucker. And Bradley subbed in for Malik Monk. And a new group in for the Knicks. Merlin's Noel checks in for Mitchell Robinson. Randall comes in for Emmanuel Josh Gibson. Let's check in for Reddish. Merlin's and Fournier Noel. subbed in for Alec Burks. As hot as he's been, it, it still has to be him who leads the charge and helps turn this game around. Score the basket. His second of two attempts. Throughout his career, Howard has dominated the boards. The size, touch, and time that he possesses is just a lethal concoction. Noel against LeBron. Nine feet out. And the Knicks getting another bucket right there. Los Angeles leading by 16. Here's James. And Throws it down hard. All the same athleticism and ability. James has no problem throwing it down in style. For New York, they've gone 50% from the floor in the second quarter, three of six. And we've got an update here, so let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. Thank you, Kevin. Anthony Davis, of course, is a superstar at both ends of the court. Brown James says his ability to guard anybody on the floor, one through five, take the challenge to guard on the perimeter and continue to protect the paint, it's hard to score on him. 
guys. PA, he is a lead in every way. As are you. Thank you. James on the phone. LeBron's got 28. And Kevin, they dialed up their activity this quarter. We're seeing them convert a lot of those second chance opportunities. The pass to quickly. Good on the triple. Emmanuel he's doing Curry. some good work from long range. I mean, he had two threes in the first quarter, and now he's got one in the second. Here's Johnson, and he gets it to go and off the back of the rim. Down. And the Lakers lead by 21. Oh, what slick handles by Johnson. He just made the D look silly there. Barrett. Oh, and the jam oh, by Barrett. This guy is a fantastic athlete. Barrett looking like a man on a mission with that slam. Working on consistency with that jumper. We can see Barrett has improved his shooting mechanics. Much more repeatable motion now. Yet another bucket in close. That's how he's earning his points today. Fournier pass to Randall. And Noel kicks to Randall. And again, New York with the triple. You can see Barrett looks a lot more comfortable now from every spot, Greg, on the floor. From three, mid-range, the free throw line. When he knocks down shots, the defenders have to creep up to stay connected. And that's when he can put the ball on the floor and get by people. And when he's on the floor, offensive rebounding is always going to be a straight for him. Greg, he keeps so many possessions alive, doesn't he? Yeah, yeah, he does. And the defense has to be aware of this. When you don't put a body on him, you pay the consequences. They grab their own miss. Bradley. And they'll get another chance. Tries it again. Here's Johnson. And the rejection by Noel. And so it looks like the Lakers will retain possession here. Never a reason. Checked in for Stanley Johnson. And the Knicks making a change here as well. Walker's checked in. And the Lakers call time here. And we all know that star players get a few more perks, but... Greg, that can also stir up misgivings in a locker room when things aren't always equal. Kevin, that's a great point. And, and coaches really have to be careful. If you're holding one player accountable and giving another a pass, that tends to lead to a fractured locker room. now and finished off by LeBron when he's driving posting up firing from deep you know LeBron has it all he's been a fantastic evening for him outside Walker can't hit that one and it's the Lakers the other way yeah, and they've shown effort and aggression in the paint really right from the tip their rebounding edge right now Why massive no, no, no. Aggressive mind state. How is showing how authoritative he is inside. And so it's Walker with it who brings it up for the New York Knicks. It's off to Utah for him after this game as they take on the Jazz. That will be their second of this five game road trip. That's in. Coming Rainbow off an assist Walker. from Randall. Walker's got 12 in the game. And he found the perfect spot behind the arc there. Big gap in the deep. And it's LeBron missing. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just, let's face it, he whiffs on that one. Inside, Noel. That's in, and he's now three for three and looking sharp. Oh, oh, look, when the D will give it to you, that's where you want your shots coming from. Arm slipped from the bucket. Here's LeBron, and they cash in right away with the quick shot. LeBron's got 34. This quarter expending tremendous energy at the offensive end. He's not slowing down. He's still calling for it. 
Walker's shot is off. Whoops. Got caught in between moves there on his way to the rack. And LeBron throws LeBron. it down. Oh, nice look by Brandy. Moving this into the open man. Knicks trail by 21. Walker surveying the floor. Rebounded by the Lakers. His field goal percentage has dipped this quarter. I mean, his movement has to be better. He has to find the open spots on the floor. That's good from Howard on the assist by LeBron. Howard's got 10 points now just in this quarter. Well, with the role he's on this quarter, they're, they're going to keep going to him and get that lead even bigger. Handle with the ball. Now guarded by Bradley. It's stolen by Bradley. And it goes out of bounds. That one's off Bradley. An easy pass turns into a terrible turnover. Anthony Davis. Carmelo Anthony. Russell Westbrook. New York's gotten it going from downtown in the second quarter. They're 3-3 three three on three-pointers. Fournier, and it is flushed down with a nice jam. Oh, great flow to that possession. Two players totally in sync with each other. Here's Bradley. Here's Anthony. Oh, yes, the turnaround. Anthony's got eight. From that in-between range, they've been the much better team. These guys have had some good motion on offense. Nice assistant. And, and when everyone's involved offensively, it, it has a way of helping you on the defensive side as well. And it's Noel with the rebound. They have a very long way to go to get within sight of the lead. And, and from what we've seen so far, guys, don't hold your breath. Westbrook with it. Now defended by Randall. And it's wide right. It's off the rim. And he rushed that one, no doubt about it. The D out of position, you can see the frustration oh, yeah, on his face. The oh, whole big finish, emphatic. He hangs on the rim just for good measure. Wow. And Anthony gets it to go. And love the muscle Anthony brings to the three spot. Takes pride in outworking everyone when he's that deep inside. And Randall throws it down. And the one hand slam just looks so pretty when it's in his hand and he's the one doing the slam. Agreed. He is smooth as silk, even on a power finish. And Davis throws it down. I mean, Davis has every advantage on this play. The defense can effectively counter him. A difficult situation for New York. Pass to Randall. Banked in off the glass. Julius Randall. Randall's got seven now in this quarter. You know, he's had better starts, obviously, but he's shaking it off here in the second. Bradley can't get it to go. Got to give him credit for his confidence. I mean, he hasn't hit a single shot this quarter, but he still keeps firing. Right side, Fournier. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Ariza's got his fourth rebound in this one. It's Davis with the drop, and it's Davis with the jam. Yeah, Davis is big, but he can move. Drives in hard and blows a hole in the defense all the way to the rim. Walker against Westbrook to the paint. There's Noel, and Noel throws it down hard. Kimbo and how about just floating to the rim on that slam? Boy, when he gets up, I mean, he gets up. Yep, it counts. And that's now 11 points for Russell Westbrook. Oh, pretty comfortable mid-range shooting. You can't let Westbrook get in the groove from there. Here's Walker. Well, time pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. Man, have they been effective at getting the ball inside. Bradley, that's for two. Gets the front of the rim and out. Well, he has to work harder to get a good high percentage look. I mean, he's been taking some bad shots. The assist is the key to that sequence. I mean, a great look to set him up. The Lakers with the ball. The Knicks making the shot. Anthony with the buckets. And when you allow good scores to get uncontested shots at the rim, no wonder you're losing. Yeah, yeah. Horrible effort. It appears they may be on the brink of giving up. Randall with the bucket. Oh, yes. And we're seeing some great ball movement out of this group, guys. Westbrook against Walker. And he gets contact and the whistle on the shot. Two shots coming up. 
Chris, fitting, right, that Russell Westbrook began a charity called the Why Not Foundation. Because that sort of sums up his attitude on the court. Put a challenge in front of him, and he'll say, why not? Yeah, he's always been fearless, and there's nothing he can't do on the court, period. And Russell's charity, you mentioned, the Why Not Foundation, does a lot of great work with young people in our at-risk communities. The first one falls. And now in the second half of his career, Russell Westbrook wants rings. He knows he's getting older and has no time to waste. It's why he plays with such passion. Looking at who's out there now for the Lakers. Horton Tucker's checked in for Ariza. And Monks subbed in for Bradley. And then for New York, Robinson's checked in for Julius Randle. Reddish comes in for Barrett. And it's Burks in for Evan Fournier. And Westbrook's high motor is why we love him. He goes out, Greg, and competes every play in every game. Uh, no doubt, but I tell you what, he's tired of missing out on the NBA Finals. This is a guy that is hungry to get back to that stage. It'll be interesting to see if he can get it done. Count the bucket, and he's got a free throw coming up as well. So we'll see Russell Westbrook go to the line here. Kemba Walker picks one up. The, line, the Lakers have gone two for two in the game Russell, at the line. Westbrook. Not really where you'd like to be as a team in terms of free throw shooting. Just about 73%. What's up? And didn't have a single free throw in that first quarter, but he started to play with a little bit more of an edge to his game here in the second. Now here's Walker. He's got 17. Driving the lane. That shot off. So Los Angeles will take it the other way. Here's Davis, and another basket for the Lakers. But when the ball goes to Davis, to be sure they convert. He is such a reliable finisher. And we have an intentional foul there, G.A. Uh, wish I could say why. <laughs> that one's pretty strange. I mean, no idea what got into his head right there. And New York making a change here. Gibson's checked in. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. Got a piece of it. Stolen by Westbrook. And no need to rush this. Let the clock run down. Yeah, yeah. No need to get the ball back here. You want to close this quarter with momentum. Anthony kicks to Monk. Hey, turn around, turn around. Beyond the arc. And so it's LeBron James making things happen for the Los Angeles Lakers. He's approaching 40 points for him in the game. He's scoring in just about every way possible. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks very much with the Lakers, Frank Vogel. Coach, with your size advantage, were you trying to get the ball to Anthony Davis inside? Uh, not any more than usual. We just give him the basketball down low and ask him to read. You know, there's been a couple opportunities where they came and doubled and he found open God. If he gets single coverage, he goes for the ball. Thanks for your time, Coach. Appreciate it. Back to you guys. Thanks so much, David, and we'll step away briefly, but get you right back out here for the start of the third quarter after this break. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back to 2K Sports, everybody. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jet Smith. Let's talk about that first half. LeBron James had it going on in the first quarter. He ended up with 36 points, three rebounds, and one assist. What do you think, Kenny, about what we saw from the Lakers? Their effort on the glass, absolutely key to setting the tone. They wanted to send a message with their physicality, and they wanted to dominate on both ends. A really terrific performance. Shaq, what did you think about New York? It's their defense that's put them in this spot. Giving up easy looks all over the place. It's like they don't have even a, a game plan in place. Check out the field goal. That's not going to cut it, man. I don't even want to talk about it anymore. <sighs> And that'll about do it as we get ready for the second half. Let's take it out to Kevin Harlan 
Shout out to my main man, Joel. Joel, what up? And there wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. What can you say, LeBron James? What an impressive effort today. You just love the patience in that first half. Waited until he got the look he wanted. Yeah, working the ball, getting clean, quality looks. I mean, just efficient basketball through and through. And with a big gap on the scoreboard, the second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to protect their lead. On the court for the Knicks. Sharing the win spot, Fournier and Barrett. Irwin's Noel is out there with Julius Randle. And it's Walker in at the guard position. I'm glad we got to see the mobile one block once more. What a play. And guys, that is lockdown defense at its finest. Going right at the shot and then able to knock it away. Los Angeles on D. They lead by the biggest margin of the game, 23 points. Lakers on D. Well, this is not the start they wanted coming out of the break. 0 for 3 so far, and they're not playing with much intensity. Count it. Bradley's got the first basket of the third quarter for the Lakers. You know, guys, fast break points right now in their favor, and, and they're really pushing the tempo. Barrett finds Randall. Back to Barrett. From 13, count it good. RJ Barrett's got nine points. They needed that. They were getting a little tense after starting the half over three. Or three, Westbrook. It's rebounded by New York. Outside Fournier to the left side wing. Here's Walker, plenty of space. And a little luck that time, but it drops. And that's now 19 points for Kemba Walker. LeBron James on the win. He's defended by Randall. No good. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. James with the bucket. He knows how to the side of the arc. I mean, James has no fear pulling the trigger when he's feeling it. Ball's knocked loose. Westbrook with the steal. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. Kemba Walker picks one up. He is three for three from the free throw line. Numbers this year at the line below 70. So when he's getting to the line, not nearly as effective as you'd like. And he can't get the first one. You know what? It's exceptional how results-oriented Westbrook is. I mean, every aspect of his game is so sharp on both ends of the floor. And he sinks the second. Third quarter here, over a minute and a half into it. Bradley against Fournier. Randall. It's in and good for his sixth field goal in 10 attempts. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. And here's Bradley from three. Randall grabs the board. His scoring has not been there at all tonight. I mean, it tells you a lot about their team. They have the been Fournier. Maybe he's not one of the elite sharpshooters, but even still, that's not a shot that he can afford to give. Him. And here is Davis following Evan Fournier's three. And here's Walker. 
He's got 19. Westbrook with the steal. Ahead. The finish. And the problem throws it down. Oh, powerful presence Russell on the court. Westbrook. It's hard to match yeah, James' yeah. strength inside. Let's take another look at the staunch defense during that mobile one block. And a block like that sends a message. One that says we're not giving up this lead. Now here's Noel. Eight points for him. Walker the pass to Noel. Back to Walker. The 11-footer connects the jumper drops. Oh, Walker. Walker's got 21 in the game. And Walker is what we call thirsty. He's thinking of firing as soon as he gets the rock. Great presence of mind from the point guard. James trying to free himself up. And it's Noel with the rebound. Noel's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Barrett against LeBron. To the wing on the left. And Noel with the basket on the assist by Barrett. Noel's got 10. They're scoring boatloads of buckets. It's raining buckets from inside. Or three, Westbrook. That one, no good. So New York will take it the other way. And the foul called on Anthony Davis. That's his first foul. Both teams deciding to change it up. Knicks trail by 18. Knocked loose. And another steal for him. And that's his sixth steal of the night. Imposing his will at the defensive end. Howard has checked in for Los Angeles. Wyatt Howard. Just over three and a half minutes through the third quarter of play now. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with David Aldridge. Good evening, Kevin. Now, the NBA does get high marks for its diversity, but there is some frustration on that front when you look at head coaches and front office positions. All-star Carl Anthony Towns said, men of color deserve a chance to lead a team, run an organization, and make their mark, not just with a jersey on, but with a suit on. Guys? Thank you, David. Barrett. He's got nine. Some nice passing by New York here. Bobbed up there for Robinson and stolen by James. And here's Westbrook from the arc. Made that one as the seventh of the contest. Seven for 15 from the floor. And guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for the Lakers. They play the heads-up brand of basketball this entire game, and they've got the steals to prove. And also, their second-chance points have been a story all night as well. But that's just pure oh, effort man. and hustle. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. For these days, so much emphasis on the perimeter game. But you can see why after that sequence. Offensive rebound. Howard goes up and lays it nice and easy. Howard's got 12 in the game. It's near impossible trying to match up with Howard's muscle. He makes scoring look easy, even though it's tough contact. Westbrook with the steal. Last break, the Lakers. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. No question, he got bumped on that shot. And it'll be his fourth time going to the free throw line in the game. Russell Westbrook.
That one is off. And he's good on the second. Here's Fournier. Nine points in the game so far. Knocks it loose. He's got a clear path. But three. Reeves can't hit. Knicks trail by 21. And given Robinson's upside coming out of college, it was a little bit of a surprise that he fell to the Mitchell second round. Robinson. And he's more of a classic big. It won't stretch the floor. You're not going to run the offense through him. But, boy, you can't teach size and athleticism. And that's what he brings to the party. Buries the long-range jumper. Johnson's got his second basket of the night. An elite passer in his position. I mean, James always seems to make the right decision. Fournier gets a wide-open look. And again, New York with the triple. I don't know why they're giving him that shot. I mean, he could get it going from three-point range if you don't be careful. Here's James, and the dunk by James. Yeah, you gotta love watching James Scott for the slam. I mean, demonstrating how high he can get up off the drive. Knicks trail by 21. New York calls timeout. Look at LeBron James. He's really been playing well. And he's just attacking the rim with force here. They need to try and deny him the ball in the paint to keep him away from the basket. some changes. Anthony's checked in for Howard. And Monks subbed in for Russell Westbrook. Taj Gibson's checked in for New York. Alec Burks comes in for Fournier. Now, here's Burks. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. He may not be thought of as big for a center, but with his ability to go vertical, he sure plays. Here's LeBron. Oh, look at him! LeBron! LeBron is so powerful. Amazing how he maintains focus even with the D draped all over. Knicks trail by 21. Takes it inside. And the dunk by James. Well, if you don't take care of the ball, fellas, that's what can happen. Absolutely, Greg. That makes the turnover even more painful. Yeah, going defense to offense in an instant. Every team now calibrated to do that. It's stolen by Johnson. And here's the break. Here's Reeves. It's rebounded by New York. Robinson's got four rebounds now tonight. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. So Anthony will go to the free throw line. Mitchell Robinson. It's on Mitchell Robinson. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. And with a percentage of 82, he's been one of their more dependable shooters from the line. Radish, he's checked in for New York.
That free throw good from Anthony. Well, you know, offensively, the style of Anthony's game, I mean, it just ages well like fine wine. I mean, you go old school, back to the basket, he can stretch you out. And he's clutch. Now, here's quickly. 13 points in the game. Gibson passes to Robinson. Over Monk. Robinson misses. For a player who's almost a sure thing to score in tight, that was a stunner. Here's LeBron. He shoots again. That's in for his eighth bucket tonight. A hot eight for 11 shooting so far. Yeah, they're going to have a nice little run here. Now, here's quickly. Punk defending. A shot by Burks. Nobody around. New York, no good that time either. And here's the Lakers. They're on a 17-7 run. And there's Monk on the assist by LeBron. LeBron's got three assists now in this one. And so it's Burks bringing it up now for the New York Knicks. Gibson finds Robinson. Driving inside. And Robinson throws it down. Whoa, that'll wake you up. He is such a great athlete. On its way from Monk for two. Kept alive. Here's LeBron. Comes up empty from 19 feet out. New York's gotten going here in the second half from outside, nailing three of four from the arc. Robinson on the wing. Count that one as his seventh bank in eight attempts. A scorching 88%. Here's Los Angeles now. LeBron with it, and Burks picks him up defensively. Here's Johnson. Not enough on that one as it misses. The Knicks shooting 64%. Beautiful all-around play by this offense. It's stolen by Monk. And LeBron with a clear path to the hoop. Pull up Jay. Changes up. And Anthony gets it to go. Anthony's got seven points here in this quarter. Controlling the defensive glass has been a problem here tonight. Quickly the pass to Gibson. Passes it to Burks. Puts up a three. And it's LeBron James with the rebound. LeBron's got six rebounds here tonight. And that one drops. LeBron's got 49 points in the game. Physical D. <laughs> when LeBron, the body control, the focus, it really doesn't matter. Johnson against Robinson. Reddish. And the rejection by James. Stolen by Robinson. That one misses. He has made seven of his nine field goal attempts. Shoots. And it comes off the front of the rim. Here's Reddish. Lays it up off the glass. Reddish has got his third basket of the night. Timeout called the Lakers. making this a runaway yeah, and the only question for me right now is just how big the lead will eventually become and that one's good and by Davis Davis, Davis has got 18 two. points in the game uh, yeah no question who's been the aggressor on the offensive glass quickly with it he's picked up by Ariza and it's out of bounds the Knicks Nick able to retain possession here Nick Walker's checked in for the Knicks Kemba Walker
137 left in the third quarter of the game. Fires the three. Sinks the three-pointer. Nine points in the game so far. He'll do some damage if they give him that shot. Don't give him a clean look. Get out there on him. Really crisp, intelligent passing to make that basket possible. Here's Walker. 21 points in the game. To the middle. Burks' shot is good. Burks has got his first two points of the night. You always hear about chemistry. That's a perfect example, knowing where each other is at all times. Davis, that's for two. Los Angeles with a fresh shot clock. And oh, he blocked it and deflects off the backboard. Poked away. It's stolen by Davis. Plays it up and banks it in. Davis has got 20 points. No hesitation at all in transition, and they have a huge margin in that department. Now, here's Burks. They get some nice contributions from him on a nightly basis as he averages over 11 points a game. The finish was nice, but the setup was better. Yeah, G.A., the pick working to full effect before the stuff. Yeah, coach is definitely pleased. That's the execution you love to see. Not a lot of resistance on the inside, and they're taking full advantage. Now, here's Walker. Monk defending. Now, Walker... He averages more than 12 points a game. That's some dependable production. And it's Gibson that time on the assist by Walker. Gibson's got his second bucket of the game to go. Nice pass. I mean, putting in work on the interior. Gotta love it. And at the end of the third quarter, a huge lead in this one may already have been decided. Lakers on top, running away with this one. Live from the Staples Center, you're watching 2K Sports. Now let's hear what Coach Tom Thibodeau was reviewing with his team in the huddle. Defensively, we got to do a better job. We got to shut the paint down. You got to challenge shots, and you got to finish. You know, GA, he's always preaching constantly. Defense, defense, defense. And it's his area of expertise, and obviously he takes it very seriously. And one quarter to go in a game that, to this point, has not been an evenly fought contest. So with James on the bench, this is who Frank Vogel is out there. They've got Trevor Ariza, Anthony out there with Howard. And there's Monk, and it's Horton Tucker in at the two. Now he hasn't chipped in with many points tonight. The good thing he has the guys around him to carry the weight. It's rebounded by New York. Reddish has got six rebounds now in the game. Pass to McBride. Down low, here's Grimes. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Ariza outside. The rebound by McBride. And maybe he thinks he has that type of range, but I'm not sure who'd agree with him. Yeah, not everyone has Steph Curry shooting ability. I, I'd be surprised. I, I, no I'd be hurt if he tries way. another one like that again. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. Horton Tucker. Good. Hey, on Horton Tucker. Yes, you made the postseason all seven years with the Kings. Deep playoff runs. Sensational play. Talk about the chemistry on those teams. Well, chemistry was very important, Kevin. I knew that being a leader of the team, that it was incumbent upon me to make sure all players felt comfortable. Not only that you would hold them accountable, but that you would include them. You know, we were a family. Shout out to all my fellas that I played with. I wanted to make them better. I hope I did. They all made me. He takes it in. Kicks it out to Gibson. Last quarter of play, about two minutes in now. New York moving the ball around. Count that bucket. That's just the product of good pass work. I mean, nice team basketball right there. 
And Los Angeles guys uh, shooting one of the high points for them in this game at 54%. Tries again, and it's Noel with the rebound. Noel's got seven rebounds in the game. He kicks it to Reddish. The three traps in the tray. A little over two and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth quarter. Here's Monk. They get it back. Stolen. And a fast break now for New York. A shot by Reddish. No good. Here's Horton Tucker. Knicks with the rebound. Noel's got rebound number eight now on the night. He's got to be disappointed with his performance, but it'll be easier to swallow if they keep the lead. And McBride gets it to go. Oh, it's all about the assist on that play. He puts it in the perfect spot. On its way from Monk for two. Here's Howard. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. What focus from the veteran. Howard is used to the physical contact. He welcomes the chance to score through. You sometimes hear people say games are called too close. Are you of the mind that the refs need to let them play? I'm just in the mindset that the refs uh, need to understand that we didn't come to watch them, and they need to be consistent on both ends of the floor. That's all guys ever complain about. When you see a guy going up to the ref, he's usually saying, hey, you didn't call that on the other end, or you called that on the other end. So consistency, I mean, these guys are trying to do their job to the best of their ability, but they need to be more consistent. I love watching Howard still doing his thing out there. A nightly double-double threat. Look, he pounces on the chance when the D falls asleep. Easy two. And it's Howard finishing it off. And watch out. You don't bring the whole basket down on top of you, young fella. I don't think he ever wanted to let go of the rim. And a little over three and a half minutes in the books so far here in the fourth. Burks dishes to Randall, and Randall throws it down. What I love about Randall is the power he plays with. He's an absolute force inside. Here's Bradley, and the Lakers get it back. Here's Howard. That one wide left. That's one he knows he should have drained. Now the pass to Noel. Ariza with the rebound. Ariza's got rebound number seven for him tonight. Burks with the steal. They get a hand on it. And the officials signal the backcourt violation. Not very careful there. Turnovers weren't a story for them early on, but that's changed. And now they're definitely having trouble keeping possession and momentum. Los Angeles making a switch here. James has checked in. And here is Los Angeles now. The shot. And again, no good by the Lakers. Knicks trail by 21. There at the pass to Noel. Tries from 10. A second chance effort. And it's blocked. A oh, tremendous reach on the block by Ariza. Making a real effort on defense. Anthony Davis is checked in for Carmelo Anthony. Anthony Davis. Here's Noel. Kicks to Barrett. Let's it go from deep. That's the sixth make from the field. He's taken nine shots and missed but three. And he's finally getting the feel from beyond. His second three of the half right there. And Bradley gets it to go. Oh, with his athleticism, nice to see Bradley drop it. And so it's Burks bringing it up now for the New York Knicks. He's given up just eight points in the fourth quarter. And, and just a step ahead of the D in that possession there, making the pass nice and safe. They get the rebound. Here's Bradley, shoots over Fournier. Bradley can't get it to go. Knicks trail by 18. Pass to Barrett from past the arc. And the Knicks hit again from deep. And now he's starting to get it going. Four three-pointers in the game for him, and three have come in this half. And another one falls. It gives him 51. Making it look easy. Uh -oh, once again, the instincts of James. Just phenomenal. I mean, he's phenomenal at being in the right place at the right time. 
and the Lakers call time here. The adjustments are a part of the game, and the coach sees something he doesn't like here. Yeah, I, I like the chess match that's going on here. Each team trying to find and, and exploit the favorable matchup on the floor. with it that shot is off James with some nice deep Davis with it now defended by Randall and Davis can't get it to go Knicks trail by 17 and here's Barrett and Fournier kicks to Burks got a piece of it Davis surveying the four over Barrett. No good off the back of the rim. New York's gone three of four from downtown here in the fourth. To the inside, Noel. And slammed dunk by Noel. And you see the passing instincts Barrett has. Great at recognition out on the floor. LeBron dishes to Davis over Noel. And James throws it down. And able to pad his stats a little bit there on that play. The board and the ball. And you know, Greg, that'll put him in the good graces of that coaching <laughs> staff, too. My goodness. Burks, the pass to Randall. And push it up for on three. Here's Davis. That's good. And so Westbrook comes up with the assist. Davis has got 22 points. So tough to contain that when he's on the roll. He's got the physicality and an expansive all around skill set. Forty trying to break loose. And then Randall slams it in. And you gotta have guts and hops to pull off a dunk like that. Randall got a lot of bump. And that one's good by Davis. And with the lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. You have to go to your best scores. I mean, it's a smart strategy. And so far, it's paying off in this game. Oh, man. Challenging the defense inside with the pass. That's just good ball. Man. He's shown great patience tonight. I mean, he went through a scoreless first half. But didn't get down on himself. I mean, now he's got it going. Barrett. And Barrett oh, slams it in. And with this kind of momentum behind him, Barrett, a terror. Love seeing him hammer it home. They get it again. Here's LeBron. He's off from 17 feet. Next trail by 17. Down low. And Barrett slams it in. Kevin, he is tough to stop when he gets to the rim. Yeah, Greg, he can get up a few notches higher. Burks against Westbrook. Here's Noel. He can't get that one. Great tee that time from Davis. Let's it go from the wing. The next pull it in. And guys, not sure where his head was on that shot. Not what this offense was designed to create. Come on, you can't be selfish. You got to be willing to make the next pass. Otherwise, you're just predictable. A baseline J. And the shot is long. Oh, you hate to let those easy chances slip through your fingers. 
you got to do is look at the rebounding margin as to why they hold the lead. Yeah, sure. I mean, when you take care of the backboard, you can the team one shot. Ow! Well, unbelievable jam from a player who's given us more than his share of great ones in his time. You're right, Greg. Defense was nothing but an afterthought on that drive to the hoop. If someone was there to contest it, it wouldn't have done any good. Here's Fournier after the basket by Los Angeles. Westbrook scanning the floor. The wing jumper off target. The rotation in the D could be better here. It, it'll cost them next time if it's not. Inside. Burks' shot is good. Burks has got four points now in the quarter. Excellent work offensively to get that shot attempted into a can't-miss area. Left side, Davis. Yes, it's James picking up the assist. LeBron's got six assists here tonight. Oh, uh, embracing contact on the way up. I mean, Davis is terrific at keeping his composure on these challenging finishes. Now, here's Burks. The feed now to Noel. And Noel throws it down. And one step ahead of the defense with that solid screen. And then Greg, the monster dunk to finish it off. Well, come on, guys. Someone has to rotate over defensively. That's just poor communication. And that's just cold-blooded right there. He's taking no prisoners. Well, that's just the mentality you have to have. Not wanting to give the opposition any hope of clawing back into this. Walker's checked in for Alec Burks. for Davis. I mean, you know, Davis's reputation really does precede him. Every time he steps on the court, the other team starts to look nervous. Now, here's Walker. To the middle. There's Noel. Oh, and he pucks it off the glass. Wow! And it's out of bounds. The Knicks will take it the other way. And tonight's battle is going to end with a very clear winner, leaving nothing to chance. Impressive win for the Lakers. Well, the one thing that jumps out in this game is the free throw shooting, which they did a much better job at. Absolutely. A, a, a big plus. And oftentimes your performance at the line can be the difference in a game. And I think tonight we saw that. And so all the hard work here tonight converted into a tally and the win column will be number 26 on the year. Important. With this win, they split the season series at a game of peace and also avoid the sweep. And that has to be a relief. And what a huge standout performance it was for LeBron. Oh, man. Anticipation, instincts, energy. All his tools were on display tonight as he lit the place up. So many of the plays they're running designed to create opportunities from deep. You see more teams doing this now. We all are firmly entrenched in the era of the three ball. And Bradley gets it to go. And you can sense that these fans, these players, they are ready to celebrate. You know they are timeout, sure. Timeout. I mean, the finish line is in sight. All they have to do is play a smart. Timeout called the Lakers. They're in front by 13. There's 49 seconds left to play here in the fourth. Get loud. Here they are. Your Laker girls. Take a look at the new balance player of the game, Kemba Walker. Yeah, and his performance has been a jaw dropper. He must have been feeling great coming into the building tonight because once he hit the court, it was all working for him. He was in a zone. And here 
is Los Angeles now. 13-point lead. Here's Davis and misses it off the right side of the rim. And Randall has got the ball here for New York. Here's Noel and slam dunk Noel. by Noel. Okay, two hands for safety. That's that's what they say, right? Uh, that's right. He was ultra safe with that dunk, no question. And the Lakers with another miss. Now the Knicks with it. It's Fournier on the wing. His three-pointer is off the mark. Out of bounds. New York New takes York possession. Ball. Checking in for the Knicks. Now, here's Reddish. He's covered closely. And hustle like that is why he leads this team in rebounds tonight. It's all heart. He does a great job of getting after it. James finds Bazemore. So it's Los Angeles win this one easily. Some good moments throughout this one, but they have the clear advantage down the stretch. Yeah, I mean, I, I love the way they executed on both ends of the floor. Completely under control for the vast majority of the game and whenever there was a misstep they just didn't allow it to fester and that's why they're going to walk away with the win and a chance now to send it over to david aldridge standing by courtside david thanks very much lebron you got after it on defense you look motivated you know i heard it all from you know is this the last that we've seen of uh, lebron and passion that he plays and then defensively um, you know, he's not very good defensively, but you can't single me out. You know, it will never be a possession where a coach or, or a teammate or a player on the opposing team will single me out defensively um, because I'm in tune with that side as well. So, you know, we got a lot of guys that play the defensive side, and it's important for me to be on that side as well and take that challenge just as much as offensive man. Seems like you took some words to heart, man. Thanks. Back to you. All right, David. Great job. Thanks so much. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Greg Anthony, Chris Weber, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA, presented by 2K Sports. We'll see you next time.